Is our technology working? Hello. Welcome to show number 36. 36, nine months of virtual shows. My name is Pat, but tonight isn't about me. Tonight is about a woman who has been donating every week for those 36 weeks. A woman who's celebrating her birthday and has a million friends because they all told me she was celebrating her birthday. Tappy Anderson. Jamie Sapp says the drinking word should be tappy. So tappy it is. And listen. I have always been responsible. I've always had a sense of obligation to God and the flag. To mom and apple pie. So I, I don't know what's come over me. Don't know where it lies, this insanity. But I have to live at least once before I die. So tonight, I want to ruin my life. I want to throw it all away in a spectacular way. Something dumb, and I don't care. I wonder if Tappy's gonna do something dumb tonight. I wonder. He goes, I, I feel like I've been suffocating, hesitating, waiting for a moment when I could even try to flap my weary arms and fly. I. I know I'll miss the family, miss the house, the dog, and the Jeep Cherokee, but I have to live at least once before I die. So tonight, I want to ruin my life. I want to throw it all away in a spectacular way. Hey, hey. Tonight. Something dumb, and I don't care. No, I won't care what happens when you close that door. I don't care what happens to me anymore. Anymore. La 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 and I, I know I'll miss the family, miss the house, the job, and the Jeep Cherokee, but I have to live at least once before I die. Are you with me, Tabby Anderson? Because Tonight, I want to ruin my life. I want to throw it all away in a spectacular way. Tonight, I want to ruin my life. 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 And if I'm going down. You're coming with me! Yeah, 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 yeah! Oh, but it's not just Tappy's birthday tonight. It's also Valentine's weekend. In the McCurdy family, we really celebrate. We go all out on Valentine's Day. The other night, the mistress of alcohol looked at me and said, you're not getting me something for Valentine's Day, are you? But I am doing love songs tonight. Paul Jones, you always come up with a good one. Lucky me, lucky me, I'm evening wear on a chimpanzee. Lucky me. Lucky me, I'm a slave to love in the land of the free. 
Lucky me, lucky me, I'm the mellow sounds of a calliope. <laughs> lucky me, lucky me, I'm in love with you, but you can't see. Oh, lucky me. Lucky me, lucky me, I'm a woodpecker sitting on a petrified tree. Lucky me, lucky me, I'm an anarchist in civilized society. Lucky me, lucky me, I'm the best at mediocrity. Lucky me, lucky me. I'm in love with you, but you can't see. Oh, lucky me. Oh, lucky me. Oh, lucky me. Lucky me. Lucky me. Lucky me. Lucky me. I'm a sex addict trapped in a nunnery. Lucky me, lucky me. I'm a surfboard frozen in an Arctic sea. Lucky me, lucky me. I'm a dirty joke in a eulogy. Lucky me, lucky me. I'm in love with you, but you can't see. Steve Massey, I got my pen today. Steve and Nancy Massey of Manitowoc, is it Manitowoc? Another love song. You lit the candle, I poured some pink champagne, and on the table was one red rose. You rip my clothes off, I rip your clothes off too. Now I suppose we'll need new clothes. Pull off your pullover, discard my cardigan, slip off your slippers, unhook your hose. We'll never find them all tomorrow morning, no. So I suppose we'll need new clothes. I'll buy a pair of pants, oh boy, corduroy. I wish, I wish that everyone could have some brand new corduroy pants. Brushing the raindrops off of your nose. We hardly notice we're getting soaking wet. But I suppose we'll need new clothes. I'll buy an evening dress someday. Gold lame. I wish, I wish that everyone could have a brand new gold lame dress. the candle, I'll pour the pink champagne, put on some music, la vie en rose, then rip my clothes off, I'll rip your clothes off too. No, I suppose we'll need new clothes, so I suppose we'll need new clothes, I suppose. 
suppose we'll need new clothes. Won't we both look fine in our new clothes? Won't we both look fine in our new clothes? Won't we both look fine in our new clothes? Last week was all about Patrick. Patrick over there on Monroe Street in Madison. Tonight it's all about Tap Dancing Kelly. Tap Dancing Kelly, another love song, sort of. I like men, I like women. I like sinking, I like swimming. I like dogs and I like cats. I like cows in cowboy hats. I like knives and forks and spoons. I like whistling happy tunes. I like to come, but not too soon. However, most of the time it's unavoidable. And that's when you hear me say it's just because you're so damn hot tap dancing, Kelly. I like everything. And I like milk. I like cookies. Adam 12 and the rookies. I like peaches. I like cream. I like field and I like stream. I like diamonds, clubs, and hearts. I like to order a cart. Gee, I like your private parts. Tap dancing, Kelly. Cause I like everything. You could never get me down. That will never happen. I will never be depressed when my step is light and my toes are tapping. So, I like Veronica, I like Betty, I like meatballs and spaghetti, I like God and I like Buddha, I like cheddar, brie, and gouda. I love cheese! I like beetles, stones, and doors, I like to shop at hardware stores, and I'd like to do you on a cheese-covered floor. Squish. I like everything. Everybody! I like men. I like sinking. I like dogs and I like, I like cows in cowboy hats. I like Field and I like Don, happy days the wrath of Khan. Won't you put these handcuffs on? I like everything. I like water, I like wine. I like to think that love is blind. I masturbate with you in mind. I like everything. I got a sandwich from Potbelly. I'd rather eat at Benji's Deli. And I love writing songs and singing them for Tap Dancing Kelly. When I ride my horse, I say, whoa, Nelly. When I'm in my office, I'm Steve Corelli. I love to write songs and sing them for Tap Dancing Kelly. I like everything. Byron, I like Shelly. Sometimes my laundry is quite smelly, but I love writing songs and singing them for Tap Dance and Kelly. Kelly, Kelly. I like everything. Thank you so much. Welcome to show 36. Celebrating so many things this week. We're celebrating that our technology works this way. All right. Let's meet the men behind the, the scenes, the men and women behind the scenes of the show. They're the same as all 36, pretty much. Pipe Jim on sound. Pipe Jim, show your face up here. Pipe Jim, we got many people who uh, donated money to you last week for your arm. For your arm, yeah. His arm's fine. It's just as big as Popeye's now. The ever-handsome Kevin Hansen on camera. High-tech Kevin, that's what we call him. High-tech, yeah, science. And don't believe the rumors that Kevin and I are not, are not Antifa. <laughs> but the person who is, is Mr. Brian Murphy on all other stuff. Look at that Brian Murphy. Oh, he's trouble. He's trouble. You look at him and say, that's a Murphy right there. Uh, let's see. I, I don't think she's available yet. 
Okay, get the ladies and gentlemen returning this week from her business trip. The mistress of alcohol is back, being followed by a beautiful, noble beast named Bo. The mistress of alcohol. There we go. Last week, Murph played you to perfection. Uh, they, uh, they, no one, he, he played it so well. Yeah, Julian still, he can't believe it. He couldn't believe it. Now, the mistress of alcohol, and while she's up here, I'm going to make myself a hip replacement. Oh, the hip bottle is going down. It's going down. The hip bottle. What is it? What is the temperature at showtime here in Whitefish Bay, Wisconsin tonight? Five degrees. Wind chill, a hundred thousand below zero. The Mistress of Alcohol. Let's do the next song. Oh yeah, that's right. Here's the tappy. Oh, tappy. Oh, I just said her name again. It's Tappy's birthday, but you know what else? I got a request from Vicki McBride, another regular. Vicki, we're coming to your house this summer, I think, for a show, right? And Tammy Cordell. I don't know if they know you, Tappy, but they want me to sing this song, and it's, it applies to you. I'm the clown at your birthday party, rub my head and pinch my nose. I'm the chap with a million laps in the polyester clothes. Oh, I'm the clown at your birthday party, look at my great big floppy feet. I'll make you smile for a little while, then you'll get tired of me. I'm here for your amusement, and for your refusement. I'm here to do some card tricks and then fall way short on the yardstick of your life. I'm not the man that you've been dreaming of. Clown at your birthday party, I'm the waiter in your restaurant. Snap your fingers, I will bring you anything you want. Oh, I'm the clown at your birthday party, I'm the clerk in your convenience store. There's no doubt I'll check you out, and then you'll just get bored. I'm here for your commanding, and for your demanding. I'm here to do your bidding so that you could say that you were just kidding too. I'm obviously not the one for you. Oh, I'm the clown at your birthday party. Look at my great big floppy feet. I'll make you smile for a little while, then you'll get tired of me. I'll make you smile for a little while, then you'll get tired of me. I'll make you smile for a little while, then you'll get tired of me. Uh, Joe Hip. I hope you didn't hurt Joe Hip on your trip to lacrosse last weekend. You kept changing your mind on what song you wanted this week. Settled on one of the most romantic love songs I have ever written. Everybody listen closely and we'll sing it together. Will you ever learn? Will you ever learn? Which way is up? Which way is down? Which is your ass? Which is a hole in the ground? Which way is up? Which way is down? Which is your ass? Which is a hole in the ground? A guy comes up and he says, Buongiorno. The next thing you know, you're starring in a porno film. And you know what happens next? Miss PG-13 is Miss Triple X. Oh, honey, will you ever learn, will you ever learn? Which way is up, 
Which way is up? Which way is down? Which is your ass? Which is a hole in the ground? A guy comes up and almost takes you hostage. The next thing you know, you're a European prostitute. Sometimes you're just too sweet. You trust everybody that you meet. Oh, honey, will you ever learn? Will you ever learn? Which way is up? Which way is down? Which is your ass? Which is a hole in the ground? At home, in the living room, all together now. I just can't stand those wolves you run with Your troubles would be over if you'd only come with me I've said it all before I will love you forever and ever more Oh, will you ever learn, will you ever learn Which way is up, which way is down which is your ass, which is a hole in the ground. Will you ever learn? 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 Joe Hip, ladies and gentlemen. It's not just Tappy's Tappy. Mm. Pipe Sisters Barb Burst Sisters Barb, you know what I mean. Emily Prober reminded me that it is Chinese New Year. Happy New Year! Let's eat! It's Chinese food. The restaurant on my street has got Chinese food. All I ever want and all I ever need. All I ever eat is Chinese food. You know, it's so, so fortunate that we have an amazing actor here tonight. A man who can slip in and out of characters like no one else. Trained by the method, the Lee Strasberg Method Actor Studio. Brian Murphy tonight will portray Emily Prober, ladies and gentlemen. Let's hear for Emily Prober. Are you ready, Burp? Keep your macaroni and your cheese. Give me Chinese food. Chinese food, and you can keep your BLTs. I like Chinese food. Chinese food. Hot dogs are too hot, and candy is too sweet. All I ever eat is Chinese food. Chinese food. Poon and Szechuan Cantonese got me begging on my knees. And Szechuan Cantonese got me begging, please, please, please. Chinese food. Chinese food. Chinese food, Chinese food, and 
not just now and then oh for a special treat all i ever eat is chinese food take out or delivery chinese food for you and me take out or delivery chinese food for you and me pork fried rice and egg bouillon chinese food for everyone take out or delivery chinese food for you and me it's all i ever want and all i ever need all i ever eat is chinese food happy new Murphy as Emily Prober. Thank you. What an actor. What an actor. Each week, we like to thank anybody who made this show possible. And this week will be no different. Even after last week's technical fiasco, we still did a show. We pulled it off, and we played 22 songs, and it was amazing. <laughs> And you sent money. You sent money, and thank you very much. To Katie Denlinger, especially Katie Denlinger. Molly Carruthers. Hello, Molly Carruthers. The Sullivans down in Alabama. Darren Bohm. I believe Darren Bohm is from Georgia. Jared Finger, 35 for 35, perfect attendance. David Hayden. Thank you, David. Julia Bosman, twice this week. Twice, Julia. Thank you. Teresa Tomzak and Amy Dumars. Amy Dumars, Amy Duvenis, Amy Du... Whatever planet's handy. <laughs> Amy DePluto. Uh, Laura Tucker. Hello, Laura. We miss you. Eric Naff comes from, oh, he wanted me to say, Regent Street Retreat Forever. <laughs> Bo Warmbold. A guy donated who has the same first name is my dog. Bobo, where are you? Bo. Bo, come here. I'm going to change his name to Bo Warmbold. Steve and Peggy are out there in a condom walk, and they're vaccinated, and they want to know if they can stand in the alley. Well, we're not in the alley right now. It's too damn cold to be in the alley. But you are invited next when we, when we go back to the alley. Derek Mosier, thank you very much. Austin Slauson is always one of my favorite names. Notch Karnick uh, in Minnesota. Hello, Notch. Carolyn Rosewall would like to say uh, a, a little tribute to Pipe's arm. So Carolyn uh, Pipe's arm is perfectly okay. It's just you know muscular now. Uh, he has he has an, uh, he has amazing musculature. <laughs> Tim Griffin from Asheville, North Carolina. I played your birthday. Remember that? I, we went out to Asheville, North Carolina, and played for Tim's birthday. Melvin Slate, Savannah, and Bryson Madison. Oh my God! I hope you guys are warm. Stevens Patrick, another one of Kevin's favorites. Rogers Hornsby and Stevens Patrick. Emily Silvison Finger, who is related. Emily wants Jared to win the Red Vines. We'll talk about that in a little bit. Lindsay Bees. Mark and Julie Degner, thank you so much. Jim and Penny Collins. I think I'm doing a request for you, Jim and Penny. Let me look, let me look, let me look. Oh, no, maybe not. <laughs> uh, Katie Griffin and Jennifer Doran. Doran. Amanda Schmert. Thank you. Amanda Schermetzler. Schermetzler. Amanda Schermetzler comes from Manitowoc and uh, wants to know when we're going to be playing at the wharf again. We don't know, but it won't be this week. <laughs> Susan Klingman. Thank you, Susan. Chris Vogel. And finally, Lorena Green. Thank you for donating and sending money and keeping this show afloat. Now, you want to win those red vines. The contest is ongoing. Complete this sentence in three words or less. I want those red vines because I'm not going to tell you some of the entries we have already, but don't forget, I, we, I have a perfect pop box to, to, I think I'll, I'll throw in some masks and some CDs. It'll be a real prize, a real prize. I want those red vines because, and of course the red vines are supplied by Peter and Janelle Mraz of Libertyville, Illinois. Pete the contractor. Every week I'm trying to play a new song.
Got a new one for Valentine's Day? Take somebody's hand right now. You know, oil and water don't mix. Neither did we, but it's turned out to be okay. We had no chemistry at all. You probably don't recall. We didn't have much to say. Then hell freeze, them pigs flew. You noticed me, I noticed you. Look at what it's turned into. Something rare and something true. You and I were bound to see eye to eye eventually. And you and I were meant to be. I think it's called destiny. I think it's called destiny. Two peas in a pod, we're both freakishly odd. We both like all the same strange songs. It's true, there's nobody else for me. I think that you'll agree. So why did it take so long? For hell to freeze and pigs to fly. See the little piggies in the sky. I suppose we knew it would, and now we're into something good. You and I were down to see eye to eye eventually, and you and I were meant to be. But the call destiny, I think it's called destiny. Bound to see eye to eye eventually. And you and I were meant to be. I think it's called destiny. I think it's called destiny. And I hope you know what you mean to me. I think it's called destiny. Eye to eye eventually, and you and I were meant to be. I think it's called destiny. John Thibodeau, it's your birthday. And you're officially old, or else Karen would not want me to sing this song for you. Because this is a song about growing old ungracefully. For you, John, on your birthday. There was a psychiatrist who said you can't go on like this. You can't go on pretending that you're 17 years old. I said that that psychiatrist, there's one important thing you missed. I know I'm not the only one who's out here having lots of fun. Go shrink somebody else's head and get your mind out of my bed. I'll grow up on my own eventually. But if I was a gambling man, I wouldn't bet on me. So then I came upon a guy from Generation X or Y or Z, or maybe he was even Generation A. He said, old man, what's wrong with you? Behaving like you're 22. Can your poor body stand the shock of being up past 8 o'clock? I said, you're right, I'm sorry, son. Fun is only for the young. I'll slowly creep into senility. But if I was a gambling man, I wouldn't bet on me. I wouldn't bet on me to do what you'd expect. Because I don't even know what I'll be up to next. I wouldn't bet on me to do the things I should. I wouldn't bet on me because the odds aren't very good. Yeah. Murph wants it faster. Or does John Thibodeau want it faster? I can do it. The watch is an account. You said, keep your money close to your relax. That's going to come and take it all away. Send that that account. That every time I have a spider, I like to buy some odds and to give the rest of all my prizes. Whatever's not like to give to all my pen oils. It'll let the ones live in luxury. Juicy, I'm not a gambling man. I never bet on me. Yeah, damn right. So then I came up, oops. 
I was so amazed at how fast I did it. I messed up the... I'm sorry, John. I'm really sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, John's wife, Karen. I was supposed to say, so once I had a lover who said, what the hell's come over you? I just can't get you off me, and I'm getting kind of tired. I said it's for the love of you. I just can't get enough of you. I think about you night and day. I'm so obsessed in every way. Your eyes, your lips, your face, your toes. I touch you once and true love grows. I'll try to find the strength to leave you be. But if I was a gambling man, I wouldn't bet on me. So many birthdays, so many birthdays, so much time. I'm just waiting for that, that mutant variant to hit Wisconsin. Just counting down the days. But, you know, people say, uh, Pat, can't you get funky? <laughs> Nobody said that. Not even, not even Tappy. Not even Tappy. Oh, yeah. I can go halfway there. I go halfway to Funky Town with the right song. Carly and Fox Point. I don't know if I'm supposed to be singing this to you. But I'll just sing this to all the ladies. How did you get so dirty? I wish I knew. How did you get so dirty? And why do I love you like I do? Why do I love you like I do? When I met you, you were so demure, so pure. You were pleated skirts and knee high stockings, young and insecure. You get so dirty. How oh, I wish I knew. How did you get so dirty? And why do I love you like I do? Why do I love you like I do? I remember how you touched my soul and made me whole. Now you touch yourself for money. Damn around the pole How did you get so dirty How oh, I wish I knew How did you get so dirty Why do I love you like I do Why do I love you like I do How did you go from How did you go from mom and dad to posing naked wearing pearls how did you go from Sunday school to making out with other girls? How did you get so dirty? How I wish I knew. How did you get so dirty? And why do I love you like I do? Why do I love you like I do? Before I met you, I was but a lad, lonely and sad. A double click in a darkened room was all I'd ever had. How did I get so dirty? How oh, I wish I knew. How did I get so dirty? Why do you love me like you do? Why do you love me like I do? Did you get so dirty? How oh, I wish I knew. How did you get so dirty? And why do I love you like I do? Why do I love you like I do? Why do I love you like? Why do I love you like? Why do I love you like I do?
come you haven't ordered my newest CD yet? Pat McCurdy, now is not the time for sad songs, a pandemic 2020 souvenir. Just because 2020 is over doesn't mean the songs are still catchy as hell. And I think Allie Lay, or Allie Lee, it's L-E-I-G-H, Jennifer Jason Lee, Vivian Lay. Vivian Lee, okay, it's Allie Lee. Allie, I think you must have the new CD. Hey, you know who gets a thank you inside that CD? Bill. His name's in there. Here's, a, here's the most romantic song from the CD. Six feet apart, six feet apart. What can we do when we're six feet apart? Six feet apart, six feet apart. I can't get close to you when we're six feet apart. If we could hold hands, that would be splendid. But our arms are too short, even fully extended. And we have to stay safe. Six feet apart, six feet apart, seems like a mile when we're six feet apart, six feet apart, six feet apart, just for a while we'll be six feet apart. I'd love to dance, but you'd have to touch me, we can't watch TV. Cause our couch is a love seat And we have to stay six feet apart Six feet apart In quarantine we'll be six feet apart Six feet apart Six feet apart Until day 14 we'll be six feet apart We can't make love that would be tricky Cause we've moved our beds Like Lucy and Ricky And we have to stay And we have to stay And we have to stay Six feet apart Six feet apart Seems like a mile When we're six feet apart Six feet apart Six feet apart just for a while, yeah, we'll be six feet. Just for like nine, ten months a year. La la la. La la la. La 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 And we have to stay six feet apart. Best performance ever. And it's all for Allie. Of course, the whole show is all for Taffy. Taffy, Taffy, oh, Peppy, banana, fanna, po, Peppy, me, my, mo, mappy. Taffy. I would like to play a song for Mark Kunkel right now. Hello, Mark Kunkel. You always have great requests. This is uh, by a band I was in 105 years ago called Yipes. And then we got together again a few years ago and made another album. The Yipes premiere of the video is out today. Featuring the Mistress of We were all a little drunk that night. But... Let me just say Mark Kunkel. This is from Yipe's second album, the one that never sold and got us dropped from our label. It's a Valentine's Day, though. I can see it in your eyes As you stumble down the streets Look at nothing in particular Ignoring everyone you meet I 
can see you're in love. Yes, I know all the signs and you got a woe. Could it be you're in love? I can't believe it's true. And I know that you feel like it'll never be the same. You feel a little bit of happiness. You're holding on to the pain. I can see you're in love. Yes, I know all the signs and you got them all. Could it be you're in love? You used to be so cold. Baby. to be the one to knock on any door and you used to laugh at danger but you're not laughing anymore now you love to be alone put your head up in the clouds and you're trying to explain that it doesn't mean a thing while you sit and watch the telephone just hoping it'll ring I can see I know all the signs and you got them all. Could it be you're in love? I can't believe it's true. I can see you're in love. Yes, I know all the signs and you got them all. Could it be you're in love? You used to be so A few weeks ago, my favorite actor, Brian Murphy, portrayed a man named Clay Morris. Well, Maureen Morris sent me some money this week to do a song for Clay. I'm trying to think of all the songs that have Clay in the title. The concrete and the clay beneath my feet. He took a hundred pounds of clay. Oh, think of all the great Gumby, all the great Gumby episodes done with claymation. Clay Morris invented that. Muhammad Ali was once known as Cassius Clay. I wonder if Clay, no, that wouldn't be, he wouldn't be related to Muhammad Ali. But Maureen, Clay, all the kids are playing with the old refrigerator, your face down on the floor. Grandma's with her skinhead friends, and Grandpa's blind and dropping. I can't get the toast out of here. I can't get it out. I can't get the toast out of here. But if I had a fork, then I could get the toast out of here. If I had a fork, then I could get the toast out of here. Well, the kids are playing with a pack of matches and a pile of oily rags. We all lying down on the operating table from carrying scissors while we're up here. And I can't get the toast out of here. I can't get it out. I can't get the toast out of here. But if I had a fork, then I could get the toast out of here. If I had a fork, then I could get the toast out of here.
just rock the shit out of that solo, ladies and gentlemen. Think of all the songs with Morris in the title. Oh, we, oh, we, oh. That'd be. All the kids are dropping out of junior high school, and you're drinking beer through a straw. Grandpa's popping to kill the president. Grandma's with her pimp. Oh, Grandma, come on, clean up your act. I'm waiting for the next big bang to blow everything to bits. We all get together on Christmas Day and sing joy to the world. We all get together on Christmas Day and sing joy to the world. Can't get the toast out of here. I can't get it out. I can't get the toast out of here. But if I had a fork, then I could get the toast out of here. A fork that I could get the toast out of here. If I had a fork that I could get the toast out of here. If I had a fork that I could get the toast out of here. Let me hear you say yeah. was the best ending I've ever done of that song. And while I'm, I'm not, we're not switching yet or doing anything, I just want this, I want this to be tuned up for the near future. So Murph, hand that over to, my, uh, to Pipe. We're going to talk about Taffy a little bit. We're going to have a few drinks here in Taffy's honor. Oh, Murph, you camera hog, get out of the way. We have more more viewers than the Foo Fighters release party tonight. So how many viewers we got? Over 400. Here we are. Ah, delicious. Oh, I'm talking about Taffy. I'm not talking about the Foo Fighters. I don't care about the Foo Fighters right now. Shame. Shame. I think that's a catchy song, but uh, Taffy's real name is Stephanie. So le let's have Stephanie be the drinking word as well. Stephanie, here it is. Which rhymes with Bethany. Now, uh, Taffy has a million friends, and I'm going to play this next song. I'm going to be in tune when I play this next song. Mm. Ah, we got a little bit of this. Let's keep that hip bottle. We're getting, it's taken a month. It's, we've had that bottle go for a month. Let's get that beer going. Let's get that beer going. Let's get that beer going. Oh, there we go. That's better. Oh, thank you, Pipe Jim. Okay. Taffy. Joe's coming over here for breakfast tomorrow? Oh, yeah. Yeah, drink it for breakfast, right? Taffy, you have so many great friends. Your friend Jamie Sapp wanted me to make the drinking word uh, Taffy. But Catherine, uh, who I sent lyrics, I've sent lyrics to you guys' houses. It seems like I know you and I don't. Uh, Catherine, for some reason, on your birthday, wants me to play. You want to know what I've been doing since you left me with a broken heart. I get the feeling that you're hoping I'm still miserable, still torn apart. You want to know what I've been up to since you walked out and turned me upside down. Well, I won't lie to you. Been going out, having fun, making friends, screw you. Going places, running wild, meeting people, it's true. Doing things I couldn't do, all those years I spent with you. Never thought forgetting you would be so easy. You only come back when you want to make sure that you're still in control. 
Now and then you have to let me know that you own my heart and soul. You don't care what I've been doing since you left me, but I'll tell you anyway. And I won't lie to you. Well, I've been going out, having fun, making friends. Screw you. Going places, running wild, meeting people. It's true. One thing you could do for me, get out of my memory. I never thought that being free would feel so joyful. So this is how the whole thing ends. You say we can still be friends. I don't believe I've ever heard such utter bullshit. Well, I've been going out, having fun, making friends sing. Going places, running wild, meeting people, screw you. Going out, getting drunk, having sex, screw you. Going out, Tinder, screw you. Going out, Tappe, screw you. Going out, having fun, making friends, what? Screw you. Such a nasty song for a birthday request, isn't it? Makes me want to sing... Well, another Valentine's song. A non-nasty song. I'll do this one for Kelly in St. Paul as well. I would cancel all my plans, appointments that I've made. I'd miss Thanksgiving and the Thanksgiving Day Parade For if you should demand Sweet love songs to be played I'll come and play for you A private serenade For whatever you desire you will, I will obey. Even if I'm tired at the end of an endless day. For if you should require a private serenade, I'll come and sing for you. I don't get paid Some things are more important than A few more dollars in my hand And I don't think that money can buy Everything I need Cause what I need is you it's that simple, I'm afraid. So you're entitled to a private serenade. I'll change the strings on my guitar. I'll put some gas in this old car. Don't care how far away you are. Drive all night to you Even if the car won't start Or the next flight is delayed I'll come and sing for you A private serenade That's more Valentinus, am I right or am I right? That's way more tappy, if you ask me. New adjective, tappy. <laughs> Two drinks on that one. <laughs> Time for another Valentine song. Same CD. And for this one, I am switching. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pick up my, my mandolin. Someone asked me, I can't remember who it was, if I would, I think it was Michael Falk. 
who asked me if I would play the theme from The Mandalorian on mandolin. It'd be hard. I, I'll put Kevin. Kevin will take the mic. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome on guest guitar tonight, Kevin Hanson. The big muscular girl got canned from that show. <laughs> the big muscular, yeah, she got she got canned from that show. Yeah, <laughs> there you go. Oh my God, this is gonna be so romantic, and this is for the showers out there in Arizona. Bruce and the gang, and all the people who are watching with Bruce and the gang. With an ocean view I'll hang my hat In any old shack Cause all I want is you I'll hang my hat In any old shack Cause all I want is you All I want is you To hold me tight Tonight, I don't want a Lamborghini or even a Subaru. I'll walk a hundred miles to see you smile, cause all I want is you. Hansen on guest guitar. Oh my God. That's such a romantic song. If you don't own my CD or stream it, you're stupid. Yeah, I'm insulting my audience because that's such a lovely song. Everybody should be able to listen to that all the time. Yeah, well. This next song is not lovely. This next song is pretty stupid. But this is the first request I am doing for my son, Julian McCurdy, who might be watching. He might be, uh, he might be, I don't know what you do in Madison, but next time you're in Madison, you're on State Street and you want a hamburger, you want a $50 hamburger, stop at Five Guys and see if there's a floppy haired guy working there behind the grill. Maybe he'll have a hairnet on. I don't know what they're going to make him wear. Yes, Julian got a new job. Yeah, and he, he texted me and said, Dad, uh, the next song that I'm going to play, that's really a catchy song, Dad. See that woman standing over there, the one who's got a little confetti in her hair, and a magnificent her arm, and a smile that could light up the sky. 
a mischievous twinkle in her eye. We've been friends for such a long, long time. It hasn't worked out very well for me. I keep hoping someday she'll be mine. But unfortunately, that will never be. Cause she's in love with a douchebag. She's in love with a douchebag. And all he cares about is himself. He don't care about anybody else. He could convince you that green is blue. Teach a psychopath a thing or two. She's in love with a douchebag. She's in love with a douchebag. And he's the guy standing next to her. He likes his underlings to call him sir. And let him know exactly who's the boss. Like Alec Baldwin in Glen Gary, Glen Ross. Like something pretty hanging on his arm. It doesn't matter who that someone is. They always end up blinded by his charm. And the sad thing is. She's in love with that douchebag. She's in love with that douchebag. And all he cares about is himself. He don't care about anybody else. He could convince you that green is blue. Teach a psychopath a thing or two. She's in love with a douchebag. She's in love with a douchebag. She's in love with an narrow-minded bastard she's in love with a hostile bigoted natural disaster she's in love with a weasel a shark a snake a predator who's always one step ahead of her and that's why I can't get to her she's in love with she's in love with she's in love with a douchebag She's in love with a douchebag, and all he cares about is himself. He don't care about anybody else. He could convince you that green is blue. Teach a psychopath a thing or two. She's in love with a douchebag. She's in love with a douchebag. She's in love with a douchebag. She's in love with. tell you, I am rocking some of these songs tonight. It's all for Taffy. It's all for Taffy. Two on that one. Here we go. But you know who else it's for? Eric Sprecher has his birthday. Happy birthday, Eric Sprecher. Dale Emmons comes from San Francisco, California. I bet it's not five degrees in San Francisco tonight. It's like 50. Mike and Jenny Conlon. Hello, Mike and Jenny Conlon. And how about Kirk? How about Kirk out there? Kirk out there in Brookfield. Brook it's Brookfield Kirk, right, mistress? It's Brookfield Kirk, right? <laughs> Kirk out there in Brookfield with the crazy kids. A new equity partner. Ooh, sounds official, Kirk. I expect you to get up right now and shake your equity partner ass back and forth and sing. I wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket. I'd like to buy some happiness, but no one seems to stock it. Sometimes I'm a tumbleweed. Sometimes I'm a... You know, I was just thinking, I got three requests from this song, plus Kirk, that's four requests. I think this might be taking over from Knock Things Over as the most requested song at this show. I think so, I, I don't know. Sometimes I'm a tumbleweed, sometimes I'm a cactus. I'd like to teach the world to sing, but no one wants to practice. I wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket. 
I'd like to buy some happiness, but no one seems to stop it. We are so fortunate tonight to have Eric Sprecher for his, for his birthday. He's here with us tonight. Eric Sprecher is here with us tonight. Hello, Eric. Happy birthday. You ready for the next chorus? I'm ready. I crawl inside a turtle shell where nobody can find me. You can't escape reality. There's no need to remind me. No, Trace, Quattro. I wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket. I'd like to buy some happiness. But no one seems to stock it. Thank you, Eric Sprecher. You can sit down now. Oh, wasn't he one? Let's have a round of applause for Eric Sprecher on his birthday. Come on, everybody. We are so fortunate tonight to have Dale Emmons here from San Francisco. Come on up, Dale Emmons from San Francisco. Come on up. If I was a Swedish fish, I would swim to Sweden. I love that godforsaken land. It's the closest thing to Eden. like to buy some happiness, no one seems to stop it. Well, thank you. Let's hear for Dale Emmons, ladies and gentlemen. Dale Emmons. Now sit down, Dale. Because it's interesting who we have here tonight. We have both Mike and Johnny Conlon. Mike, both Mike and Johnny Conlon are here tonight. They're color coordinated. Let's hear from Mike and, and Johnny Conlon, ladies and gentlemen. I'd like to see the whole wide world. I'd like to go to China. I'd meet a pretty woman there and play with her computer. Everybody sing! I wish I had, I had a monkey, monkey paw. paw. I put it in my pocket. I'd like to find some happiness. Can we hear it from Mike and Jenny Conlon? Okay, sit down, guys. I'm writing a new verse. I don't want to go on trial or get blacklisted like Ring Lardner. I want to be just like Kirk and be an equity partner. Come on, Kirk! Kirk! He's here tonight with us. Come on, Kurt. Sing it. Go. I wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket. I'd like to buy some happiness, but no one seems to stock it. Oh my God, this is an amazing night to have all these guests with us. Now sit down, Kirk. I'm going to do the last verse on my own. Sometimes I'm industrious, sometimes I am lazy, and sometimes I sing campfire songs. It drives the ladies crazy. Oh, you know it. I wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket. I'd like to buy some happiness, but no one seems to stock it. We are for Brian Murphy portraying many, many roles tonight. Right. And then, can we do one more love song? Can we do one more love song? Can we do it? Mauricio Lopez! Mauricio Lopez, he's a lover. He's not a fighter. Yeah. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you what I'm thinking, but you're reading my mind. I want to tell you what I'm thinking, but you're reading my mind. I want to tell you what I'm thinking, but you're reading my mind. I want to tell you what I'm thinking. You and I are nuclear power. We're freaks of nature, aren't we? If you and I could get paid by the hour. Just think how rich we would be. I want to give a little, get a little every 
night. I want to give a little, get a little every night. I want to give a little, get a little every night. I want to give a little, get a little every night. I want to pack it up and shack it up and do it again. Pack it up and shack it up and do it again. I want to pack it up and shack it up and do it again. I want to pack it up and shack it up and do it again. Because you and I are nuclear powered. We're freaks of nature, aren't we? You and I could get paid by the hour. Just think how rich we would be. Won't you think how rich we would be? I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you what I'm thinking, but you don't know. I want to tell you what I'm thinking, but you're reading my mind. I want to tell you what I'm thinking, but you're reading my mind. I want to tell you what I'm thinking, but you're reading my mind. I want to pack it up and shack it up and do it again. I want to pack it up and shack it up and do it again. I want to pack it up and shack it up and do it again. I want to pack it up and shack it up and do it again. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. Okay, quiet in the living room. This is the most important song of the night. Because this is the actual song that Taffy Anderson requested. Stephanie! Nobody in my neighborhood sees me sleeping in the bushes in my yellow hat. My big black boots made of Indian rubber. And my heart in a shopping bag. And nobody in my neighborhood hears my private conversations with the little people who live in a house inside my head. Me and the seven dwarves. And nobody in my neighborhood wants to know that I'm alive. They see me standing on a corner and walk on by. Nobody in my neighborhood knows I'm watching what they're doing and writing it down on tablets of stone. They don't believe that I'm Mr. Jesus Christ, the King of Kings. And nobody in my neighborhood wants to know that I'm alive. They see me standing on a corner and walk on by. They hear me howling at the moon and they know that I am. Nobody in my neighborhood or don't exist in a traditional way. My voice is the wind, my body's a tree. And my clothes are yesterday's new. Nobody in my neighborhood sees me sleeping in the bushes in my yellow hat. My big black boots made of Indian rubber and my heart in a shopping bag. No, nobody in my neighborhood wants to know that I'm alive. They see me standing on a corner and walk on by. They hear me howling at the moon as they walk on by. They see me lying in the street and they walk on by. But I remember a time it seemed so long ago. When we sat in the moonlight. Somebody sang, sang a song so sweet, they sang it just for me, they sang, tonight you're mine, completely, you give your love so sweetly, tonight the light of love is in your eyes 
but will you love me tomorrow? Happy birthday, Taffy Anderson. Oh. Let's all drink to Taffy. Let's uh, everybody at home too. Raise them up. No fussing, no feuding. Who else do we have to thank for this show tonight? We have to thank Jan and Doug. Jan and Doug from San Diego. Uh, D Doug was in Canada last week. Back in San Diego, I hope. Hope uh, happier times. Karen Reiner, thank you, Karen. Kim Peterson. Mary Beardsley Keller, one of my favorite names. Should be royalty. Should have a daughter named Eugenie. Courtney Bialik. Courtney Bialik from the UW-Madison Union. Angela Patton. Thank you, Angela. And two-year-old Sammy. It's not the time for sad songs. Dave Hallbrooks. Thank you very much. I hope I did some of your top 26 tonight. I hope I covered some of the top 26. Tom and Sue Dorgan. Tom and Sue Dorgan. I don't know where they're from, but it should be Oregon. Kelly Cuss comes from Raleigh, North Carolina. It's funny because I used to live in a little town just about 90 miles from Raleigh. It was called Mount, it was called Mount Pilot. And every so often we would go visit my cousin, my cousin Andy, who was the sheriff of a place a few miles from there called Mayberry. <laughs> Bruce and Sylvia Haroldson, thank you very much week after week. Jason Bondi, Jason Bondi. Anna Fisher, thank you to Anna Fisher. And Cheddar, Chad, no, yeah, Cheddar, I'm thinking Chad, but I'm also ch thinking Chad Reddy from out there in the La Crosse area, out there in Minnesota. Pam and Corey Melkars, uh, Pam and Corey, Corey, the proprietor of Clark Graphics, oh, Clark Graphics, for all your graphic art needs, and I'm going to have some graphic art needs, can I get in touch with you, Corey, I need some graphic needs for this summer. Uh, they're perfect attendance, let's hear from them right now. Vicki McBride, we did a song for you already, so forget it. Rod Wilhelm is out there in, in Colorado where it's colder than it is here in Wisconsin. Joe Bryan. Joe Bryan, and I think we did something for Pam last week. Billy Berger. Billy Berger, you also once requested, I want to tell you that I love you, but you already know. So, uh, oh, guess whose birthday it is? Along with Taffy Anderson is Ashley Merle. Chris says, happy birthday, Ashley. Uh, the Giffords, no birthdays for the Giffords out in Massachusetts. Hello, Giffords. Where's the requests? Where, why did you run out of requests, Gif Giffords? That's my question. Dave Winsell wants to know why I don't make shirts like French guy in love with a bowling pin anymore. <laughs> and I don't make shirts because people lost their sense of humor right around the year 1999 or 2000. And nobody bought them anymore. But if you would like me to design or bring back the French guy in love with a bowling pin shirt, uh, if by popular demand, I can do it. Uh, we have one to show, I think, somewhere. Yeah, you, I think it's up in the office, in one of the offices. We have many offices here that we rent out to people. We rent an office to Barb Olson. <laughs> oh, uh, Brian, and Brian and Diane Kita, uh, that's Kita, K-I-T-A, uh, live in Lake Zurich, Illinois. I just, I don't know, something about that, that town, Lake Zurich. You're like, hee -hoo. Yeah, let's, here, toss it. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's like a million years old. You don't want to put that thing on you. What? Oh, God. <laughs> this is what a French guy in love with a bowling pin shirt looks like. <laughs> Look at it. Yeah, it's a little. Yeah, and you notice I was Cordner, so I wrote love, 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 love all over the bowling pin. S work it. Supermodel, work it. Ow. Leave your outfit on. <laughs> yeah, we'd have to get the screen. We'd have to make a screen. But if you want one of these, you can you can let me know and I will make them again. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> a million dollars. Uh, Sally Dick uh, says, "Yeah, you're done. <laughs> That's all the modeling we need for now." Yeah. Bobo comes up. The mistress leaves, and Bobo comes up. Uh, Sally Dick says, hello, Molly. Somebody ran away from home. I don't know the whole story because it, was, it just came to me before the show started. Let's say happy birthday to Sean Fisher. Sean Fisher. Hey, come on. Let's do a birthday to Sean Fisher. Come on, guys. 
Come on, you guys are okay. Uh, they, now listen to this name, Greg Wanschneider. Happy birthday, Greg Wanschneider. And then we have a shout out to Carol Medina and Betsy Wasmer. Thank you for watching the shows. And you know who else? We, what, we're done now, Mara. Yeah, one more. Oh, whose birthday? Carol Jones, Shane's grandma's birthday is today. Oh my God, Tappy, you are sharing your birthday with many, many people. Another drink to all the birthdays. Mm. Up there in Fond du Lac, can I say hello to Cheryl Andrews? I think this song is so appropriate. I don't know if you watched any of the uh, impeachment mock too. He's gonna get, get away with it. Because in the United States, we will impeach you if you had an illicit sex act. But if you promote terrorism and have the Capitol be trashed and defecated on, that's okay. But I'm not worried. Cheryl's not worried. And I'll tell you what. It's a great lead up to this song. Life's too short to... <laughs> now that I did the lead off, I can't do the damn song. Life's too short to sit around the house, drink until you're deaf and dumb and blind. Life's too short to do what everybody tells you you're supposed to do. Life's too short to wake up feeling helpless, tired and afraid. Life's too short to waste one second, one minute, one hour, one day. Life's too short to argue and to fight, to make each other cry night after night. Life's too short to think we gotta act like everybody else does. Life's too short to wake up feeling useless, tired and blase. Life's too short to waste one second, one minute, one hour, one day. short to dig yourself a hole to set yourself on fire to save your soul life's too short to think you gotta act like everybody else does oh life's too short to fill yourself with hate when things don't go your way right cheryl life's too short to waste one second one minute one hour one day Life's too short to waste one second, one minute, one hour, one day. One more! Life's too short to waste one second, one minute, one hour, one day. Didn't think I'd get around to you, Eric Brock, out there in San Francisco. City of hills and dispensaries. I don't know what's going on in the rest of the world. I don't know what's happening with all the 400 plus people who are watching this show. I'll tell you what's happening in this house. They're driving on sidewalks and pissing in gardens. They're saying excuses and begging your pardon. Everybody in this town is drunk. Everybody in this town is drunk tonight. Why don't we bring up Mike and Jenny Conlon again? How about it? You mind, Eric? They're walking on tightropes just like in the circus. 
The screaming obscenities from cars with no purpose. Everybody, everybody, everybody in this town is drunk. Everybody, everybody, everybody in this town is drunk tonight. And they're making a chorus line up and down Main Street, swaying and staggering out of control. They're spitting and swearing and laughing at everything, laughing at me. Drinking from bottles and cases, all different religions and all different races. Everybody, everybody, everybody in this town is drunk. Everybody, everybody, everybody in this town is drunk tonight. Mike and Jenny, you have never sounded better. They're drowning their trouble, they're drowning their sorrows. They'll start up again when they wake up tomorrow. Everybody, everybody in this town is drunk. Everybody, everybody, everybody in this town is drunk. One more time. Everybody, everybody, everybody in this town is drunk including Taffy. Thank you, Mike and Jenny. Thank you, everybody, for watching the show tonight. I will see you next week, February 19th. The technology will work. Where are you going, Murph? I mean, where are you going, Mike Conlon? St. Paul, in his letter to the Ephesians, said it came to me upon a midnight glare. Finish writing all of my gospel. Now all I seem to want is sex and men. Mark Antony looked down on Caesar's body. He said, friends, Romans, countrymen, lend me your ear. I did not come here to praise Caesar. I came here. For sex and bear, sex and bear, sex and bear, all the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear, sex and bear, all the things we like around here. Almost the whole damn bubble is up here. Am I right? Am I right? Yeah. George Washington, he never crossed the Delaware. There was no midnight ride for Paul Revere. Ben Franklin never discovered electricity. They we're too busy looking for sex and bear. Sex and bear. Sex and bear. Are the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear. Sex and bear. Are the things we like around here. Now Charles Dickens gave us great expectations. Shakespeare gave us Hamlet and King Lear. Dostoevsky gave us crime and punishment. Taffy Anderson gave us sex and bear. Sex and bear, sex and bear. Are the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear, sex and bear. Are the things we like around. Now they could take away our pride and our dignity. They could use up all our blood and sweat and tears. They could take away our names and give us numbers. <laughs> but they will never take away our sex and bear. Sex and bear. Sex and bear. Are the two things we hold dear? Sex and bear, sex and bear. Are the things we like around here? Why don't we get the whole bubble up here? Come on, Kevin Pipe. You don't have to dance. You just have to stand up here for the last chorus. Come on. We'll have the whole bubble. 
36 weeks of this bubble right here. No one going anywhere, no one doing anything. Here we go. Sex and bear, sex and bear are the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear, sex and bear are the things we like around here. What do we like? We like sex and bear and sex and bear and sex and bear and sex and bear. Thank you, everybody. We will see you next Friday night. Thank you so much. I love you. Woo! Can't stand the stress and I can't stand the strain. Can't stand the fog and can't stand the rain. I hate the hatred, the stupidity. Can't stand the liar. Lying to me So Mr. Jameson That's why I'm calling you I think I figured out What we gotta do Let's have a party Let's have some fun Call up your best friend Tell everyone Let's get together Let's do it right Put on some music and dance all night. I'm tired of races. I'm tired of their friends. Looks like blue meanies are in Pepperland again. Can't stand the poison they're spewing out. I turn down the volume, still too loud. So, Mr. Jameson, that's why I'm calling. gotta do let's have a party let's have some fun call up your best friend tell everyone let's get together let's do it right put on some music and dance why I'm calling you I think I figured out what we gotta do